what is up everybody and welcome to another video where i'm doing the same content for like the fourth week in a row because i don't have anything better to do and i have an addiction now in case you couldn't read the title we're gonna be opening another elite trainer box i already have three videos of me opening elite trainer boxes i have the first shining fates one and then the second one in a stream and the second one edited down uh Watch those most recent two. If you want a long experience, you can watch the full VOD. It's uploaded. And if you want to just watch it in the same fashion as the first video, then I have that uploaded too. It uh, came out a few days ago. Well, as of recording it, as of the time you're seeing this, it's probably about a week ago. Now, as you could see, we do not have a Shining Fates like you can see right there in the background. We do not have one of those in... In this video but we have a battle styles elite trainer box which i'm pretty sure not pretty sure which i'm sure is the newest uh set in the pokemon tcg i actually got two of these i got one of each i got the rapid strike urshifu and the single strike urshifu but i'm gonna save one of them and i might buy like one more just so i could open one of each and have one of these boxes just like for display so i don't just have the the rapid strike uh, the reason I'm opening this one is primarily because it is a little bit more beat up. It's got, like, some bends in the corners and some tears in the uh, plastic wrap. But we're going to open this, and I might be able to bring you some more uh, battle styles openings. And hopefully I'll be able to get my hands on one of the premium collection boxes for Shining Fates. Because I really, I really want that Charizard, <laughs> like, badly. But uh, I'll see. I don't know. I don't have infinite money. I don't even make money off this stuff. It's basically all just money that I've accumulated over holidays. So we're gonna transfer over to the other camera real quick. And here we are. So we got this beautiful, beautiful box. It is actually very nice looking. And yeah, I'm gonna open that. I'll see you guys in a second. All right, here's what the box looks like. Uh, it's very similar to the Shining Fates one. When they changed the style to have like this cool angular shape, I, I just, I, I feel like it just looks way cooler than the old boxes where they were just rectangular. We got the player's guide that comes in all of the Elite Trainer boxes, and we'll pop it open and see what else we got. Alright, we got the card game rules. Don't care about that. Get that out of my face. We got this piece of cardboard, which is in all of them just to make it look bigger, I guess. It's also to hold some of the taller items. We have some deck separators i don't know what they're actually called they're called something like that spacers maybe i have no idea what they're actually called and we have our oh that's a weird they're in a piece of plastic we have our uh energies our many energies which we also do not care about and we have sleeves i'm gonna pop these open see if they're as good as the shining fates one because if they're not i'm gonna use the shining fates ones until I'm out of them because they are very nice. I'm assuming they'll be the same. And yeah, no, they are. Okay, cool, because I love these sleeves. The old official Pokemon trading card game sleeves that were made by the Pokemon company were not amazing, and they were pretty fragile. The new ones, I don't know when they started using them because I didn't get back into this until Shining Fates, but they're way nicer. You know, ooh, you can actually see my deck of rares right here. That's the Rillaboom that we pulled in the stream. And then under it is the Grimmsnarl that we pulled in the first pack um, of the first video. So I am going to be using these sleeves. And I'm just going to put them in my uh, Shining Fates box that I had them in in the stream. So I'm going to get that real quick. All right, I got my Shining Fates box. This has got all the sleeves in it. So... I'm actually gonna pick these up and I'm just gonna shuffle in these Urshifu sleeves. All right, we got our sleeves exactly where they were when we did the stream. And then in case you couldn't pick that up, here's your code card for the box. And we're gonna just put the code card off to the side. And the nice thing about these, oh, one, one last thing, we got our counters and our dice. Anyway, as I was saying, the nice thing about these is they're a bit cheaper than the Shining Fates ones because these have eight packs instead of 10. Now, 
It is a sacrifice, but it's a sacrifice worth taking. I was able to pick these up on Amazon for about 50 bucks. And the last two Shining Fates boxes I got, the first one I opened, I got 70 for 70. And then the rest of the ones that I got, I got for 80 each. And I got two more after that first one. Now, I gotta say, I love the pack art on these. Do I like them as much as Shining Fates? No, but that's because I love all of the Pokemon on Shining Fates a lot. Like, Empoleon. I'm not even a big Empoleon fan. It's definitely one of my less favorite starters, but it looks sick. Tyranitar. Amazing Gen 2 Mon. And then we got both Urshifus. That's Rapid Strike, and that's Single Strike. So we are gonna finish off with Urshifus. I'm actually gonna finish off with a Rapid Strike one primarily because that's what the box is and i'm gonna start with a single strike one we'll end with two urshifus that's that's the plan here all right now that i'm all situated uh might as well just get into it why not so we're starting off right here we have a single strike urshifu pack and let's get opening Ooh, that boy did not open nicely I'm going to have to try to save them better next time. Hold up. Here is your code. And let's get into it. I'm pretty sure it's still four from the back. I'm going to figure out if that's the case right now. That's four. And yeah, we're starting with an energy, so I was right. We got a water energy, a car coal, a dotler, a pig knight, a shinx, Cacnea, Ponyard, Timber, Tepig, a Reverse Scroll of Scorn. Oh my god! No way! Yo! No way! First pack, it's just like Shining Fates. My first Shining Fates pack was a full art. We got a full art Tapu Koko VMAX. We are sleeving that boy on up. I just reached for the completely wrong thing knowing that I purposefully put these here. So we're gonna sleeve this boy on up. Let's go. That's a bang, that's a massive pull. Look at this beautiful card. Let's see if we could get that. This is my, this camera right here is my not as good camera. So I'm gonna go to this one and see if we could get it to focus a little bit better. Cover my face. Ah, I'm bad at this. There we go. That's sick. All right, we're going to put that off uh, to the side when we go over our good pulls. And this is a trash uh, pack art because I tore it apart. So that was nice. Next up, we got ourselves a Tyranitar. I'm going to try to be more careful with it. Beautiful. Let's push these cards on out. Here is your code card. All right, and we have Fire Energy, Fan of Waves, Dotler, Indeedy, ooh, whoops, Frillish, Esper, Blipbug, Silly Cobra, Lickitung, ooh, a Reverse Cacturn, and Conkeldur. I'm gonna sleeve the Reverse cards, actually, because I've been doing that. All right. Next pack, we got some Empoleon art. Maybe we could pull the Empoleon card. I want to pull the uh, alternate full art uh, Tyranitar card because that one just—it's just sick. I want—I actually want to pull the alternate full arts of the Urshifu forms because I'm pretty sure those are the best cards in the set. So that's what we really want to pull. But I would not complain with the with the Empoleon or the Tyranitar because those cards are really cool. Here is your code. And we got Grass Energy, Cacturn, Rapid Strike Energy, EXP Share, Silly Cobra, Bellsprout, Onyx, Spiro, Sizzlipede, Reverse Girder, and a Vivion. Okay. Alright, we got another Tyranitar pack. Here's your code. All right, Dark Energy, Tower of Darkness, Karina's Focus, Carcoal, 
Spiro, Pachirisu, Cherubi, Mienfu, Mr. Mime, Luxio Reverse, and a Marowak. All right, we're getting some kind of dog water right now. Not gonna lie. Right now, it's kind of trash booty butt cheeks, which is not valid. We got that one pull so far. All right. Empoleon again. There's your code. Psychic energy. Single strike scroll of, scroll of scorn. <laughs> Single strike energy. Oh, I didn't even say the Bisharp. We got a Bisharp too. Horsey. Mankey. Mawile. Fomantis. Remoraid. Reverse Octillery. And a Lickitung. Damn. Lousy box. All right. Tyranitar. All right, here's your code card. Fire Energy. Crawdon. Dewblade. Cacturn. Esper. Blipbug. Silicobra. Lickitung. Houndour. Reverse Galarian Slowpoke. And a Hollow Meowstic. Okay. That's not bad. It's better than most of the stuff we've gotten, other than the... Other than the Coco. So, can't do too much complaining. Alright, we got our single strike Urshifu pack. Here's your code. Alright, we got Fighting Energy, Camping Gear, Seedra, Scroll of Swirls, Spiro, Pachirisu, Cheruby, Mienfu, Mr. Mom. A Reverse Vivian, and a Jellicent. Jeez, bro. Nothing. Alright, on to our final pack. Our Rapid Strike Urshifu pack. Here is your code. Alright, final pack. Let's get it. Electric Energy. Rapid Strike Style Mustard. Cheryl. Heat More. Horsey. Mankey, Mawile, Fomantis, Remoraid, a Reverse Spiro, and our final card. Hey, okay, this is actually a good card. Let's go. Rapid Strike, Urshifu V. Good thing I saved that Rapid Strike pack for the last one because we pulled that Biosh. Let's go. I'm actually happy about that. That's not that bad. I mean, I looked it up, that card for being a non-full art is uh pretty all right so i can't really complain about that at all that's probably our best pull i'm pretty sure that's better than the full art uh tapu coco all right so our lame ass battle styles elite trainer box gave us a hollow meowstic a full art tapu coco v max and an urshifu v you know it was bad when there's that many stuff, when there's literally only three, uh, three poles, and one of them is just a plain hollow. So, that was a very underwhelming box opening. I'm gonna call BS, and that it is a resealed box. I hate everything, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, enjoyed watching me waste $50 on a box and that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces.